Hey, y'all, it's Tim Miller with The Bulwark, and the financials are out on uh, Donald Trump's social media site uh, since we've posted the podcast today. So I wanted to come back on here and talk to you about just the utter business disaster that is Truth Social. I mean, if you thought that Trump stakes or Trump water, or Trump airlines, one of his other failures was bad, I, I just, or, or the fact that this guy is the only person that can't make money running a casino. I just I can't imagine how a company could have a worse balance sheet than Trump Social. This is out this morning. Um, we'll pull it up here. Uh, the Trump Media and Technology Group. Uh, this is their operations for 2023. Since they became a public company, we're going to talk about their stock here in a second. Since they became a public company, they have to now release their financials. They generated only four million in revenue last year. 4.1 million. I mean, I know there are some YouTube feeds that you see me on where those guys are making more than 4 million, uh, just like one person in a YouTube channel. And 4 million is nothing. And this is, um, you know, like this is barely, they're barely, this is like a mom and pop corner store level, uh, level income generation here. But then let's look at the losses 58 million in losses. I, I, uh, how can you be bringing in four and, and putting out 58 with no sign of growth? Uh, it's not as if, oh, there was a big outlay of money this year because, you know, this this company's going to ramp up and, we're you know, we're making widgets. And once we make all of our widgets, then we're going to sell them all. And in a few years, we'll make all the money back. Not, there's no ramp up on True Social. If anything, True Social is stagnating or declining. $58 million, up to $58 million, uh, like, what what is this business? Thirty nine million of the fifty eight was interest expenses, and they had fifteen, almost sixteen million in operating losses. I'm going out into sweats here, just thinking about if the Bulwark's balance sheet looked like this, like I would be in a total panic, blowing into a paper bag. Devin Nunes, you might remember Devin Nunes, the former congressman that tried to sue people for making fun of him on the internet. It's the free speech party. Uh, failed in that lawsuit. Uh, he tried to sue a, a Twitter account. I think it was Devin Cow or Devin's Cow. He tried to sue. Cow won. So Devin uh, is running Truth Social uh, into the ground. Uh, I just an absolutely... Uh, like you should, you, this could be in a business school class um, for things not to do. Uh, so this is this is the operating expense of the company. Where what is the deal here? What is the grift? Okay, and let me tell you. So they they took this publicly, and Trump's plan is to make money off of suckers that buy stock in this just lemon of a company, um, in, in the hopes that then he can get enough cash to like pay for his legal expenses. That's that's the grift that's running here. And uh, I I do have some bad news about capitalism and about uh, Donald Trump, and and that is that that plan seems to be working for a little while. The stock had its IPO recently, and um, it, it ended up with a market cap of six billion. Six billion for a company that only generated four million income. It had a six billion dollar market cap because a bunch of morons bought this stock. But notice where it is today: down to forty-seven. These financials came out, and even the buffoons that were investing in this meme stock, it's kind of a racist meme stock, were like, "Whoa, the bottom might be falling out of this one." So they're down to forty-seven. Uh, that is down to about twenty-four percent today. Monday, April 1st, not an April Fool's joke, uh, down 24%. And uh, and that chart there, that trajectory is uh, going down more and more and more. So look, not here to offer financial advice. How the hell am I? I mean, how could you offer financial advice in this? Anybody investing in this is totally irrational and disconnected from any potential actually profit and loss um, results of this company. But, uh, I, you know, I, I think that Certainly, if you're interested in shorting the stock, it seems like there's a lot of evidence that it should be shorted uh, because the company is a total failure. I, I mean, just an utter, complete, absolute failure. Nothing, nada. In huge debt, creating no income, nobody's using this site. It is a zombie site. It only exists for Donald Trump to put up his insane conspiracies and like all caps derangement um, for like a small handful of super fans to read and then for it to be screenshotted and put onto other social media sites where normal people are so I, I that is that a business I don't I don't think I don't I don't believe that to be a business um, speaking of his crazy posts I did talk about this on the podcast today with Bill Crystal which you should go check out his Easter message 
how is this person, how is anyone considering this person to be president of the United States? I mean, if you had a colleague that posted this on social media, you would be t- talking to HR about how they need, they need, they need therapy. They need, they might need a break. We might need to give them a, a little hiatus from the office because we don't want somebody posting in all caps about how America is a failing nation and crooked people and derangement. And uh, I mean, look at this, like evil and sick, fanny, fawny way. Like, what are you even talking about? This doesn't make any sense. It's in all caps. This is his Easter message. This is a person with deep psychological problems. It's a person that is totally failing to run his business. And um, that is our news of the t- news for today, Truth Social. We've seen the numbers. They are even worse than you could possibly imagine, uh, headed down the same path of all the other Trump failed businesses and bankruptcies in a long career of failed businesses and bankruptcies. We'll be back with more. Uh, make sure you subscribe to the Bulwark YouTube page, and uh, we'll be seeing you soon. Hey, if you like this video and our content, I'd love for you to become a Bulwark Plus member. You get bonus podcasts, uh, you get bonus newsletters, you get bonus takes from me that maybe don't come up on the YouTube feed. Um, you can try it out for free at thebulwark.com slash free trial. The link is below in the description. Uh, we'd love to have you as a member of our community. Uh, we have great commenters and uh, great opportunities for people who want to protect democracy.